what up virgo welcome back to the channel it's your girl Jeannie, and you already know what it is so let's just get into the energy because the energy for you is beautiful today all right the intuitive message i got was get up and dance all right and then i got the song get up and get down and then the last song that i got was virgo get up off of that thing all right so it's time to dance it's time to dance um it's time to release some pressure virgo in the song he repeats over and over again get up off of that thing it's time to release some pressure so spirit is wanting you to find something that brings you happiness brings you joy that boosts your confidence okay something that your heart desires you to do something that you really have been wanting to do whether that's been dancing moving exercising something virgo i also got that big push of being active and like getting ready for the for the springtime because it's hitting off in the springtime for you so spirit wants you to get ready now for the springtime okay so you could be starting a new diet new exercise routine whatever but i feel like there's a shake up here there's a need to uh, get up and release some pressure get up and release some weight get up and release something Virgo. okay get moving bring happiness into your energy change up the routine all right relieve some pressure in some type of way because something definitely is coming in and i feel like they want you to be ready all right what's the get up off of that thing energy for virgo what's the get up off of that thing energy for virgo we got counterpart. What's this energy for Virgo? Get up off of that thing. Counterpart energy. Hell of a girl. And then we have angel holding your hand. Escalated sudden wealth. Wow. Direct download. Hype man. Look out the window. So you're being hyped up right now. Okay. This counterpart to a hell of a girl. I feel like you're getting backed up. A boost of confidence. This is angelic help at this time. All right. So whether you're a male or a female, Virgo, you fought the good fight. Okay. You've gone through a lot. And I feel like spirit is countering with you at this time in order to get you up, get dancing, boost your confidence, to give you what your heart desires in order for you to release some pressure. All right. Because I'm getting this angel, this counterpart that's connected to you has escalated things for you in the way of your finances. We have given wings. This is definitely angelic, okay, spiritual prosperity. All right, at this time, spirit wants you to not to wait on anything. 444 with the listen energy. They want you to listen and move. Virgo, listen to what they're saying. What they're saying right now is get up and dance. And get up off of that thing and shake till you feel better right that's the energy they're gonna give you a boost of energy they're gonna give you a boost of confidence they're gonna give you what your heart desires in order to bring happiness to you in order to release some of this pressure virgo all right so spirit is escalating things at this point <clears throat> what's counterpart there's also something here big about direct downloads in hype man okay looking out the window all right, you could be like uh, dissociating, um, just like, what is it called? Daydreaming and spirit comes in your daydream and gives you a direct download that boosts your confidence, Virgo, that hypes you up. Like, you can do this. You were, you were that bitch. You were that dude. I feel like, Virgo, you're going to have moments where spirit is like partnering with you to directly boost your confidence, directly lift you up. We have empath and green thumbs and outside so there's something here about you being empathic and needing to grow something and, and needing like sunlight okay you could be wasting time <laughs> okay self-sabotaging no it's time to get up and move virgo get up and move what's counterpart energy for virgo we have dealing or release okay we have work work achievement and success and we have dealing a relationship with a man blonde hair gray or white okay so remember this energy here was someone who was passed on um birth or conception disappointment in some affair and secret admirer hmm. situation required okay how can i make this easy for virgo <clears throat> Thank you. 
counterpart here. Work in Fairman. We have ideas, sudden realization, intervention, sudden realization, time pressure, and ripple. This is what I mean. Okay, there is a man, okay, for some of you. It doesn't have to be a man for all of you, but this is someone who has passed on. This person is helping you in the ways of like good ideas, sudden realization, the power of innovation, Virgo. This person is helping you work cheap and excess in the way of direct downloads. We saw that energy earlier, okay? You're just gonna be sitting there and all of a sudden you get a direct download that's hyping you up, okay? That's boosting your confidence because you're under some type of time pressure, okay? The time is right for something and it's having a ripple effect here, Virgo. So you're being pushed towards healing, okay? What's this hell of a girl energy for Virgo? We have muddled, unclear thinking. Yeah, you could be confused at, at this time. You could be confused at this time. Stagnant, maybe? Situation requires careful handling. We saw that. So you're about to be boosted. We have family matters at the bottom. Pleasure with a friend and opportunities are waiting for you. And then we have good fortune. So you're about to be pushed. You're not thinking clearly. This situation is cause for careful handling because there's a time limit. There's a time restraint. The time is now. Yeah, you have to be ready by spring. So the time is now. They're giving you sudden realizations to achieve, how to achieve, how to get more money, how to work better, Virgo. Um how to do something better it's almost like pulling you out of the forest pulling you out of this muddled thinking keeping you on track and towards the things that your heart desires so there's like a shift a dynamic shift a mind shift playing out in this time so spirit's partnering you with this time to keep you aligned keep you in check they want you to get up get moving stop allowing your mind to keep you in uh unclear thinking virgo yeah the time is now the time is now when you're moving slow. Okay, slow moving will take a while. Slow and steady, don't rush. You're moving slow. Spirit's here to counter with you because there's a time pressure and you're moving slow. So um, they're here to hype you up because there's a gift coming. You're receiving something, Virgo. Something unexpected is happening. You're being rewarded. You're about to achieve some type of goal. You're moving faster. They need you to move faster for this. So they're about to give you a gift in, in order to help you move. Okay? All of a sudden, you're going to have the power to control your emotions, the power to manipulate your emotions. Like, you're not going to be sad over anything anymore. You're not going to self-sabotage anymore. There's going to be a big push, okay? Something that gets you up, gets you dancing, boosts your confidence, all right? Gives you happiness. Something that releases the pressure of muddled, unclear thinking, Virgo. All right? Tell us about these good ideas, time pressure, and counterpart. Get up off of that. And work till you feel better. Hey, get up off of that thing. Oh, shit. Get out of here. We the Queen of Swords, the Nine of Pentacles, and the Page of Pentacles, Virgo. So what I'm seeing is there is definitely something that you are ready to communicate. Okay? The Nine of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles. So these ideas are going to be given to you. And then you're the one who's going to communicate this and with the nine of pentacles and the page of pentacles there's something that you're doing on your own that will that's this opportunity so you're going to get the idea you're going to express it whatever you express is going to help you with the nine of pentacles receive because the nine of pentacles talks about um material well-being it talks about riches it talks about your well-being okay and being able to take care of yourself by yourself and with the page of pentacles it talks about an opportunity all right it talks about news physical news it talks about financial opportunities so i feel like virgo there's something that's going to start in your mind but then you're going to be able to express the things that you need to in order to take care of yourself okay being a um this is all about your financial stability six of swords we saw that energy earlier so you may be given ideas to make money by yourself Okay, entrepreneurship ideas. You may be making money from home, different avenues, Virgo, and be a way of you speaking or just coming up with ideas from your mind. 
has giving inventions, is giving, creating things just out of your head. You don't even know how you got the idea. You don't know where the wisdom came from. But when you apply it, you have that financial gain. Six of Swords, there's something here that's moving you mentally into a better place. Okay? This is going to allow you to succeed in the things that you are passionate about. This is muddled, unclear thinking, slow gifts, arrow, energy for Virgo. There is also the need for you to be single and independent for this opportunity. Okay, so if a counterpart is coming in towards you and you are still entertaining, no bodies, okay, you are still entertaining other things, there's no room for a counterpart, um, you're not going to get that opportunity. So there's a need for you to be disciplined, know the truth, stand in your um, power alone for this opportunity, Virgo, because even if you look like you're alone, you have a counterpart already who's helping you figure out something. So take that as it resonates. But we have the Page of Swords, Seven of Swords, the Six of Swords. And the Six of Wands, the Ace of Swords. So Virgo, you're about to be shown something. <clears throat> you're about to be shown something. You're about to learn something. It's a strategy in order to move you into a better place mentally and successfully into clarity. Okay, because we have muddled, clear, unclear thinking, and then we have clarity here. So with the Hermit energy and the Temperance energy and the Six of Cups. And the Wheel of Fortune, I do feel like you have someone from your past, the past thorn energy with the temperance, could be a divine angel here who is helping you see things. All right. Learn a strategy. What's this energy? Page of Swords, the Chariot, in order for you to move forward in success, Virgo. What's that? The King of Cups. What's the King of Cups? <clears throat> the Lovers. The Seven of Swords. The Three of Wands, the Seven of Wands, and the Sun card. So with the muddled on clear thinking here, Virgo, you're about to see something that, that allows you to see that something is like false. Someone is false. Muddled on clear thinking. So if you thought you had a counterpart, Whoever that person is, is false, a demon, the devil, uh, rebuke them, okay? Keep up your boundaries, Virgo, because that's what that muddled, unclear thinking is about. You could be seeing someone that you thought was your counterpart, but you are in alignment with your counterpart. This person is in the spirit. So anybody in the physical right now that says that they're your counterpart is a fucking liar, okay? They're in the spirit with you, helping you get a real opportunity, real opportunities. That's for some of you. For others of you, there could be some type of weird um, muddle, unclear thinking because you see that someone wants to move towards you. There could be a king of cups. You see that this person wants to love, come towards you. You could be hearing a lot about this being a love offer or a love option. But with the seven of swords and the three of wands and the seven of wands and the sun card, Virgo, it's like this person is a liar. I feel like you waited long enough to... I feel like, Virgo, you need to turn your back on some ideation, some type of... Um, idea and block something for clarity so if there is a lover that you think is your counterpart if you keep hearing that you're about to get back with a king of cups or some lover is blah 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 that's all false you need to block it in order to get clarity because you're muddled and unclear about that that's for some of you okay or if that is not you this person is muddled and unclear virgo and you need to block them in order to see clearly take it as it resonates all right and closing messages for Virgo. Closing messages for Virgo, please. We have the two of wands in the reverse. The king of swords in the queen of wands. What's this energy? The strength card. What's this energy? <coughs> the eight of wands, the queen of cups, and the ace of cups. You know the truth, Virgo. So there's going to be someone here. Um, what's the two of wands in the reverse? 
Page of Pentacles. What's the Two of Wands in reverse? The High Priestess. The Magician. What's the Queen of Wands? The Leo card energy. Queen of Wands, Strength. Five of Swords, the Knight of Coins, the Ten of Cups, and Nine of Wands. There is the energy closing messages. There's the energy um, someone having some type of weak plan. Because the Two of Wands in the reverse talks about abuse of power, tyranny, or someone who's weak. <coughs> And I feel like there's somebody who's trying to abuse your power, abuse their power by communicating. Okay? With a strength card and the eight of wands, somebody is here. I feel like Virgo, you're very confident in your communication. I feel like you're very strong. You could be communicating from a heart space at this time. Or this is what spirit wants you to do, okay? Because somebody here, they could be trying to abuse their power over your, like, mind, high priestess, the magician. Oh. Okay. So with the two of wands in the reverse, Virgo, you could be hesitant here. Because I feel like <clears throat> um, I feel like spirit is wanting to tell you that there could be a person who's coming towards you when you're in your strength and your power. And this person is going to communicate with you and they want you to be in an open, loving energy. Because this is an Ace of Cups. There's a new person coming towards you. Okay, but there's something that could defeat it. Your, your energy could... Uh, I'm not saying defeat it with the Five of Swords. But your energy could conflict with the love coming in. Because you are... Let's just say you're a little resistant here, Virgo. You've gone through adversities, all right? But with the Queen Pen, the High, the high Priestess, and the Magician, this is something that you have manifested, okay? This is something that you're manifesting. What's the Two of Wands in the reverse? The Empress. Yeah, this is a new beginning for you. The Four of Cups and the Higher Third. This is a new beginning here. The five of coins. The ace of swords at the bottom. The page of cups. The tower. It's giving me. <clears throat> it's really giving me the energy that you could be hesitant because. With the Empress, you could have just, you know, <clears throat> started over. Let's see it full in the Five of Pentacles. The Judgment. Virgo, you... Oh, shit. The Seven of Cups. Okay, Spirit wants you to get ready. They want you to get out of the mood. They want to boost your confidence. They want to give you everything that you want. They want to bring happiness into your life, but they need you to release some type of pressure because you could be muddled and unclear because of the things that you could be hearing about some type of past person. But if you continue to block them out and look towards clarity, they'll eventually just like leave your life. All right, but Spirit is wanting you to focus on yourself at this time because there's somebody who's going to be communicating with you Virgo, when you're feeling confident, when you get that confident energy, um, but you could defeat whatever is coming to it because, um, because when when you meet this person, you're gonna just start looking good. 
<clears throat> all right hold on when you meet this person you are just gonna be um back feeling yourself back looking good <clears throat> yo my nose just got stuffed up out of nowhere hold on <sighs> okay so when you meet this person you're gonna just be looking good there's gonna be something happening for you and with the five of coins in the judgment virgo when you meet this person you're gonna have this fear of starting over and then it ending quickly judgment so you're weakening something by prejudging a situation um by forecasting that some weirdo is coming back it's almost like you're self-sabotaging because you keep expecting some narcissist to come back you're wasting time and self-sabotaging because you're not exercising and boosting your confidence and getting ready for this um virgo you may have this ideation like i'm never gonna get love um and blah 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 so spirit is asking you to get up dance shake that shit off work out whatever you have to do to make you back in this empress energy to put you back in this empress empress energy because what you have thought of is manifesting you remember the sudden realization and time restraints yeah okay so what you thought of is manifesting and spirit needs you to be ready for it and they need you not to self-sabotage okay so this is what i got here for you virgo Time to do that self-care, time to work out, boost your confidence, work on things, heal from things, be open and ready for what you have manifested to come into your life. Don't allow past relationship and pretenses, false pretenses to determine and dictate your future. There are blessings coming in for you. There's a counterpart angel in your energy that is helping you realize things and get ready for something and be ready at the time that you need to be ready because you are moving slow at this time because you are still unclear about something. Get real clear, Virgo. No matter what you hear on TV, YouTube, or anything, no matter what you hear, you are not getting back with a past person. That person is not going to make it work blah 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 no rebuke it in the name of jesus you have a new gift new energy a new person coming into your life Virgo, and you have manifested this person you need to be ready for it all right so get up off that thing get up and dance boost that confidence do what you got to do to bring that happiness and joy back into your life the spirit wants you they want you dolled up and ready all right they want you lined up and ready if you're a man they want you smelling good and ready okay so this is what I got here for you, Virgo. If you resonated with anything here, please give me a like, comment down below. Subscribe to the channel and see what's coming up next with Virgos. And y'all already know, I'm very grateful and thankful for everybody watching. Peace.